Hey everybody, to, uh, today is November 24th, 2020. This is the update for the presentation uh, for the week of November 23rd. I know we got a short week uh, with Thanksgiving. First of all, I wanna wish all of you a blessed Thanksgiving break. I know this is uh, challenging, unusual times for what Thanksgiving may look like for you. Let's all be grateful for even the little things that we have that make a big difference in our lives. So uh, with that being said, um, Let's get on with today's game plan. As your Sherpa guide, I want to just kind of go over a couple of reminders for all of you. Yes, I will go over the expectation for today's game plan um, as a uh, presentation piece. Let me slide this up here a little bit. So with that being said, I also want to just remind everybody going back to the far left-hand corner of the resource column under your product that is due. Make sure you have this in. As I scroll down, there's the gold grade gold agreement form make sure that is filled out we have limited amount of those we don't have everybody in this is where you have to decide and i'm going to start today's session with all of you to make sure you have that so uh scroll down take a moment this morning take a moment right now don't wait don't say i'll do it after this seminar webinar nope do it right now please if you would get that completed hit enter because we want to make sure that agreement is good to go as we move forward one of the major changes we've made uh, to help you become successful. So let's slide over to today's present. As you already know, before we begin each and every day, go to the present card and keep this in mind. I'm gonna sound like a broken record. All you're doing, all I'm doing is help support and you answer these five questions. What have you learned? What have I made? What obstacles have you had? What goals and how can I improve? We have already created a template for you. And I'm gonna talk about today's focus is the script. And as you already know, too, going down to the present expectations reminder, ongoing updates, that's a huge mouthful. Whew. That's where all our work is done. So let's open up that doc here. And there's a quick re rehashing of, you already know, the base level versus above and beyond. Uh, kind of, I also included this time, this trimester, a new reminder of uh, today, for example, I'm working with the juniors in their English course civics class, looking at those specific um, driving questions. That's always a great reminder for you as you go to create your presentation. Also, a quick reminder from the last two weeks, where were we? Where are we today and where are we going? That's always my thinking when it comes to this, this seminar opportunity. Well, where were we last week? Last week, where was science? 11th graders, 10th graders, freshmen. Uh, we already created a base level. Um, I took all your, uh, shall I say, your template or your rubric and created a template with all your driving questions. Already did it for you. I feel like a used car salesman. I mean, for $19.95 a month and $21 down a month, you can drive out here with a brand new car. Well, anyway, not a used car salesman, but everything is set for you to drive this work on your presentation. Got it all set up for you. Even if you're doing above and beyond, you can take these five basic questions and you can build from here. Now your slideshow, which is your script, by the way, for base level and above and beyond, because if I'm doing above and beyond, I may want to take these elements and put them into a video or do it on a website and build imagery or knowledge, understanding that I, un I understood the concept. So that's where we've been and where we're at today. Today we're at an opportunity. I don't want you to sit here an hour and a half with me I want to schedule some meetings. I'm going to talk about that in just a little bit. Also, keep in mind, um, going back to the English Google Slides, I want to make sure we created this for you uh, two weeks ago. Um, this is for the 10th graders. It's not for you juniors, but we need to do that in class today. Create a template just like I did with the uh, science. We'll be doing that later on today. But here's the new, I don't want to say new. I don't want to keep saying new every week, but uh, kind of another way of tweaking that I really want to maximize your time. Under each week, like today, when we're done here with this intro uh, and answering your questions, I'm going to have you leave the Zoom meeting. Yes, go. Go eat your Fruit Loops. Go get yourself ready for the day. Go get caught up. And then I want you to schedule an opportunity with me. Here we go. On the 24th for English 11, you're going to put your name in there. And what time? First come, first serve. I'll probably populate those with the times later on today. So this is a time where you have a one-on-one -on -one with me during flex learning time. I want flex learning time to be more meaningful. I want it to be more engaging. 
I want this hour and a half to be more for you support. So we come together at 9 o'clock.